Hello there, it's Fabienne Fredrickson from boldheart.com and I'm going to be talking today about something that I haven't talked about here before, but I believe that it may be if you are a woman in business or a man who leads with his heart in business and in life, it might be just the thing to propel you into success. Here's what I mean. I did a talk about a week ago in London, a full day talk called Your Business Your Way, the feminine approach to unprecedented and authentic business growth. And in front of a room of 150 women and a few heart-centered men, I talked about the fact that the masculine has been rewarded in our culture for the last 5,000 years. And because of that, we women especially have been acting just to be rewarded, to be recognized. We've been acting more masculine than we really feel. In fact, we have been <laughs> succeeding by putting on a, an overly masculine mask. And I believe that the consciousness is shifting rapidly. It has been rapidly shifting, shifting for years. And we are at a critical impasse in the world of business, in the world of how you put yourself out there in the world, where the old ways of being, the old, the, what used to work, will very quickly become obsolete. In marketing, it will become obsolete to hit people over the head with a two by four. It will become obsolete to take instead of give, to compete instead of collaborate, to, uh, the, the new way is empathy, love, compassion, collaboration, um, authenticity, vulnerability, um, lots of other stuff, integrity. <laughs> and all of these things, if you look at the energy between masculine and feminine, all of these things that I'm sharing with you are feminine energies. And whereby the old way was overly masculine, the new way that is being ushered in is one in which it's, it's, it's a softer approach, if you will, more authentic, more loving, etc. And so I want to ask you, perhaps you too, and this is what resonated with the, run, the room full of 150 people in London, uh, ask yourself if you've been showing up in your business, in your marketing, in how you promote yourself in the world in a masculine way. Have you, do you feel like perhaps um, you have to hide who you really are? You have to be behind a mask, put some walls up and, and not be vulnerable because you fear criticism and judgment. Um, is there a part of you that is holding back on your light? on your wisdom, on your femininity, because you fear that it's not going to work in business. If that's the case, and you have been holding back, I want to give you permission to show that side of yourself, to show the feminine side, even if you're a man, to uh, show compassion and love. Because here's what happens. And I've been talking about this for a long time. Who you're marketing to is a person. And every single person in the world wants to feel seen, heard, understood, and loved. And many people that are following you, who perhaps want to work with you, aren't loved very much, even at home. And when you can show that side of yourself, when you can market in a more feminine way, you will see people pay attention to you in a way that they've never paid attention to you. They will, people go where they are loved. And so I invite you, not that you need permission to, but I invite you to show up more as yourself. Be more of the authentic you, the fullest expression of who you really are at home with your friends in your daily life. I invite you to put down the persona, put down the mask of who you've been being because you thought that that was the way to succeed. Um, if you're interested in this, I'm going to be doing, it was such a success in London, I'm going to be doing um, a full day around this in New York in June, in September, in Paris, and probably another one in London soon. Come and spend the day with me. But until then, this is your inspiration for today. Show the world who you really are, unapologetically. I'll see you next time. Bye.